Today we wanted to present the women's side of the story. We feel that the report was such a small sliver of what the reality of the marching band is. We as women did not feel like predators. We didn't feel like we were unusually sexually charged. We were college students and the marching band has provided us so many opportunities that we have become stronger, more resilient, aggressive, and successful women that we wouldn't have been without the marching band. We don't feel like we were predators or preyed upon. We don't feel that our male counterparts were predators. We were all in this together. We were a family and that women, now that we are labeled as being in a sexualized culture, we want to come together and say that that's not what we really are here and that's not what reality is here. And as a former band member, I want to point out that we were all college students and we acted like college students. Does that make it right? It makes it appropriate for the time. People were always on point to make sure that everyone was safe, everyone was having a good time, and if nobody wanted to participate in anything, they didn't have to go. I think the university should conduct a much better, much more thorough, much more broad, appropriate investigation, and then come to a better conclusion instead of a knee-jerk reaction.